Welcome back. In this video, we will learn how to find the solution of a set of simultaneous equations by the method of substitution. So let's get started. Here we have a set of simultaneous equations y equals to 2x plus 1 and 5x minus 4y equals to 2. Now when we say that we need to find a solution of these simultaneous equations, what we actually mean is we need to find the values of x and y. Let's call the first equation as equation 1 and this as equation 2. To begin with, we substitute the equation 1, which is y equals to 2x plus 1 in equation 2. So we write 5x minus 4 and now instead of y, we substitute equation 1. So open brackets 2x plus 1, close brackets and that is equal to 2. Solving this further by opening brackets, we get 5x minus 4 times 2x is 8x and negative 4 times 1 is negative 4 equals to 2. Now adding the like terms 5x and negative 8x, we get negative 3x minus 4 equals to 2. Now to isolate x, we first add a positive 4 on both sides. Now negative 4 and positive 4 cancels out and we have 6 on the right hand side. So we have negative 3x equals to 6. Now to find the value of x, we divide both sides by negative 3, which gives us the value of x as negative 2. Let's call this equation as equation 3. Now to find the value of y, we could substitute the value of x, which is equation 3, in either equation 1 or 2. So let's say we substitute equation 3 in equation 1. So we have y equals to 2 times negative 2 plus 1. Negative 2 times 2 is negative 4. So we have negative 4 plus 1. Negative 4 plus 1 is negative 3. Therefore, we have y equals to negative 3. So the solution of the two simultaneous equation is x equals to negative 2 and y equals to negative 3. Finally, to check if our solution is correct, we substitute the value of x and y in either of the two equations. So let's say we substitute the values of x and y in equation 2. So we have 5x minus 4y equals to 2. 5 instead of x, we write negative 2. Minus 4 instead of y, we write negative 3. That is equal to 2. 5 times negative 2 gives us negative 10. Negative 4 times negative 3 gives us positive 12, which is equal to 2. On left hand side, we have negative 10 added with a positive 12. That is 2, which is equal to the right hand side. After checking, we can say that our solution x is equal to negative 2 and y equals to negative 3 for the two given simultaneous equation is correct. I hope you enjoyed learning from this video. Please like and share the video and subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching.